we're starting with 45 grams of hydrogen and we want to know for uh, how many moles of HCl. So you can tackle this as a conversion question. So 45.0 gram H2. Uh, and I want to convert into a mole HCl. Uh, now, if I uh, had my uh, hydrogen given in moles, then I could read uh, my uh, conversion out of the equation here, because I know for each mole, there's one here of hydrogen, there's going to be uh, two mole of hydrochloric acid. So I know one mole H2 is two mole hydrochloric acid. So if you think about this in my conversion, this will kind of be my last step. I want to go from uh, mole H2 to mole HCl, so I have two here and one here, and then I will end up in mole hydrochloric acid. But now there's one step missing, which is I need to go first into mole H2. One mole H2 is how many grams H2? H2 has two hydrogen, so one mole H2 is two hydrogen. Then we go into the periodic table and we look at the mass of hydrogen. So the atomic mass of hydrogen is 1 0 0 8 or 1 0 0 8 grams H2. So if you calculate this, uh, or I can write it here, 2 times. 0, 8, sometimes being a bit lazy can pay off because look at this two here that cancels each other out. The one cancels out, then the unit cancels out, the unit cancels out, and what I get is that I can calculate my answers as 45 grams divided by 1.008. So 45 grams divided by 1.008. Four point six three significant figures. I started with three grams of HCl. Uh, wait, not grams. Uh, more, right? I end up in more. So forty-five the grams cancels out. Forty-five divided by one point six or eight is forty-four point six more of HCl. 